Katie, another strong weekend for Pirate Volleyball. Uh, you dropped a match on Friday night at Lewis Clark State, but the very next day you were able to beat Lewis Clark State in a match at Whitman, and then you beat the Blues uh, also on Saturday at Whitman. So give us your recap of what you saw the Pirates do this weekend in those three matches. Yeah. Um, Friday night, I thought we competed well at times. We were just inconsistent. You know, we were facing um, a strong, powerful team. Um, LCSC had some great right sides, a faster pace offense. So it, it took us a while um, defensively with our block to adjust to that. Um, but once we did, I was proud of how we competed, you know, point for point on Friday night. I think at the end, what ultimately decided that match um, was more on our end. I think we had some unforced errors, some missed serves, um, and some things that we felt like coming into Saturday we could change and control. And I was really pleased with their mindset of how they kind of regrouped um, and came in with a lot of confidence and an urgency to compete and to win. And you, you still have lots of room to grow mm -hmm. with this team. Yes. Uh, how does playing a, a physically imposing team like LC State prepare you for, for more matches this season? Yeah, I think um, it's so great to have um, compete against opponents like that because we get to um, kind of adjust our block against some, you know, taller, pretty dominant hitters. Um, and so being able to train kind of our vision and defensively, um, being able to dig, you know, balls that are coming at a pretty fast pace, um, having to, you know, really earn our kills, you know, because they're a great defensive team. We had to um, compete in some pretty long rallies. So I think all those things just um, make us better, but also kind of help prepare um, leading into next weekend and then in a conference knowing that we're going to have um, really tough opponents as well, but, you know, hopefully we'll be prepared for that high level of play because of opponents like LCSC. And you've won some really close sets mm -hmm. so far this year that have, that have gone down to the wire or gone into extra points. Just talk about how mentally tough this team is looking yeah. this early on with such a young squad. Yeah, yeah, they are. Um, I think we found ourselves in a position where, um, at least in that third set against LCSC, we, were, we had to come from behind, and then we took the lead. We were up 24-21, and then they came back and tied it. Um, and in a moment where it looked like we were really, really struggling, we were able to come together um, and, and score two solid points. And so that really does speak to just their mindset. We talk about mental toughness a lot, but it's really hard to coach. So I'm, I'm really proud of my athletes for being able to kind of find that within and, and finding strength and, and trusting each other. And I think with each win and being in those close moments um, just continues to give them that confidence for the future. This weekend, our, our final non-conference weekend of the season, uh, hopefully till we get to postseason, mm -hmm. but we'll see how that plays out. Uh, you're going to play some pretty tough teams in Colorado. Talk about the caliber of, of opponent that you're going to see there. Yeah, I'm really excited. We've never played Colorado College. We've seen them at the national tournament. We've heard about them. Um, you know, right now, one of the top teams in our nation and having to play on their home court. Um, so just really excited for the opportunity and just to see how we match up um, and I think our girls are um, excited for that as well and the two other teams even though they aren't in our region are also um, kind of nationally known elite programs. We played Transylvania last year in Atlanta um, and they're tall, long, athletic so I just think overall um, to have that tournament where you know every single match is a high level and you have to be at your top and at your best um, is is really what it's all about.